Hey guys, today I'm going to be sharing with you a fashion haul. We're going to get straight into it because I feel like I have a ton to show you. So if you guys follow me on Instagram, and if you don't, why aren't you yet? I was wearing this dress and a lot of you guys were asking where it's from. This is always a challenge, but it is from Urban Outfitters and I saw that it's still on the site so that's why I wanted to include this one real quick. It's from Silence and Noise. It is very, like, it definitely drops pretty low in the, you know, armpit area, so if you are going to have this area exposed, I definitely suggest wearing a bandeau unless you like that side boob action. It's really cute because I like how it kind of has, like, this swoop right there. And definitely check out my Instagram if you want to see how I styled this for a slightly warm winter day, evening. Okay, now moving on to ASOS. I saw these boots. They're, they have a chunky sole, it's over the knee type of boots. I'm just not sure how I feel about these because it's like so, you know, heavy on the bottom because of the chunkiness. And then this part is just so thin. It feels, it just feels a little off balance when I walk in them. But I don't know, we'll see. Let me know what you guys think. I also got this skater dress in a, this like cream color. Ooh, it's gonna be a little bit washed out here. I think I might return it. It definitely is like a little bit on the sheer side, so you should wear a slip underneath it. I think if the quality was just a bit better, and if, if it was just like a little bit thicker, not as see-through, I might have liked it more. I also got this dress. It's a structured knit dress, and it's in this navy color. It has like a V cut out in the back, and it's just so cute. I love this so much. I actually wore this while I was out in LA. You can see pictures of me wearing it on my blog, so definitely check out my blog, imxdinner.com. I also got this dress, so I went kind of dress crazy just cause like, you know, when events and things come around, I just buy at least a few just in case, just to, just to have different options. So I also got this one. When I showed it to Matt, he had very like mixed opinions about it, but I think it's pretty cute. So I don't know, what do you guys think? I just think, this is the type of dress that you could dress up, dress down, dress kind of edgy or grungy, or dress really like feminine. So, you know, I, I just like things that are versatile like that and floral with black. For me, that's just like so easy to style. The last thing I got is this clutch from Skinny Dip. I actually had considered, it has a chain in it too, by the way. I don't know why it has like this funky color chain, but it also has like a gold chain. I actually had considered wearing this with my blue knit dress, but for some reason I didn't. I think because it's just a bit on the chunkier side, like for the hands to hold. I think if it was just maybe a little bit smaller, it would have been like perfect. But I don't know, I still really like it. And it's spacious, so it's pretty spacious for a clutch. All right, next I also picked out some items from Choice. I'm really, really happy with my order this time around because it can be a little hit or miss. Um, definitely another site with, you know, kind of trendier items, but not the greatest quality for the most part. So it's kind of like Forever 21, except the most unfortunate thing is that they can be very limited in sizes and their sizing usually does run pretty small. I got a couple accessories. I got this really cute dainty necklace. It just has like a little leaf on it. I really like this. I think it was only like two or three dollars. I also got this headpiece, which I actually haven't tried yet. Let's, let's try to put it on right now. See what happens. Oh my gosh, guys, I love this. I feel like a, like a goddess or princess or something so that kind of gives you an idea but oh, I love that so where do I even begin let's start with something more basic so I got this crop top it is like a three-quarter sleeve it's just simple love it I actually have a dress in a very similar black and striped pattern to this I also got this shift dress I really like shift dresses neutral tones and I love this. I actually really can see myself dressing this one up or down as well. And it just fits me really well. This one is in a size medium. I also got this two piece, which is on sale right now. And it is so adorable, guys. It is this mint colored two piece. This is like a crop piece, but then it has, you know, the lace kind of hanging out the bottom. So even though it's cropped, you don't really, it's like your stomach isn't completely bare. The lace is kind of covering it a bit. And then there's the skirt with that. And I also got this in a size medium and it fits me pretty tightly, just to give you an idea. And for a two piece, this is pretty affordable. So I'm really happy about that. 
I also got this dress just because it looks so pretty online and I thought it would be perfect for Valentine's Day. Look how pretty. It is a little bit on the short side. It does run a little bit short. Also, this elastic part right here is pretty tight, but I guess it's better that it's tight than you feeling like it'll slip down because it does sit over the shoulder like this. And it's really, really cute. I just think this would be like the perfect thing to wear for Valentine's Day. This only comes in one size, which is ridiculous. I know guys, so sorry about that. This would fit petite girls really, really well because it's not too long, so this would look adorable on you guys. My last item from Choice is this coat. It's this, you know, fuzzy coat, and then it has this beading uh, detail, which was my favorite part. I mean, I love fuzzy things too. I'm like a huge, I'm just like obsessed with fuzzy sweaters and things like that. It looks a little bit, you know, chunky on, but I think I'm gonna, gonna work it, maybe wear some really nice tight faux leather pants with it, which I'm about to show you in a bit, but yeah, I love it. It's just very edgy, but fun and cozy at the same time. It's not extremely warm. It'll give you a little bit of warmth, but yeah, it's not like extremely high quality or anything like that. Lastly, H&M, another one of my favorite, favorite stores. I got this top, just really, really nice and casual, kind of, did I go size larger on this one? No, I got it in a size four. I just got it because I really like how it's a very loose, relaxed fit. I just, I just love that casual, effortless look. So I got that, and then like I mentioned before, I got another pair of faux leather pants. My last pair I've had for ages, and it definitely started getting tight on me, so I got another pair. Um, I told myself to size up. Yeah, I got these in a six. I also got these pants. They kind of remind me of the American Apparel Disco Pants, I think they're called, because these are also high-waisted, and it has like that kind of shiny look to it. The only difference is that I'm pretty sure the disco pants do have pockets on the backside and these don't. I kind of wish they did though, just so, I don't know, sometimes that back pocket just makes you feel more covered, but it does have a zipper. I probably will still wear them like pants. They're so comfortable, I can see myself wearing these a ton. I also got this sweater because you can never have enough sweaters, can you? It's just very simple, once again, very like, slouchy fit. I think this one does go over the crotch area. Yep, it does, which is awesome because I could even wear them with leggings if I just needed to run out. It has more of a v-neck cut. And then lastly, this is definitely making me crave spring, but this top, this cute floral top, I think it's really, really adorable. Love it. Can dress it in an edgy way or a feminine way. Um, I could definitely see myself wearing this with my faux leather pants. So, I believe that is it for my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. Really, really happy with most of the things I got this time around. So let me know which pieces were your favorite down below, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!